got a cloud, I think. Uh, Wait, I think that's a chicken. Yeah, there's a chicken. Rocket ship and Earth. Looks like two eyeballs. It's abstract. <laughs> this package comes from Addison, who sent us the capacitor. A, it was about a month ago. So this is round two for him. I think he's got a crash. It does. We have no idea what this is. I think it's Colonel Mustard in the ballroom with a rope. Yeah. This is the non-related separate contents for a second, second video. video. And this is a... There we go. The pneumatic something. Pneumatic nailer. Give us a mallet. Hey, we forgot to read the note. Oh. Please cut our flooring nailer. This flooring nailer is a backup to our backup nailer. That makes it third in line. It would bring me pleasure to see my vessel scuttled by the finest. <laughs> Consider it scuttled. <laughs> Look at the picture and how to put this thing together. Okay, we got this piece here. This screws that there. That holds the nails. You think we're geniuses here? He even sent us a picture and we still can't figure it out. I think this goes inside of this thing. They just have the same hole pattern, okay? Mitchell's just trying to figure out how to use an Allen wrench. <laughs> I don't think that's right. That's not? And I just found this in the bottom. Sorry, disassembled the nail for shipping. Please reassemble before cut. Pretty straightforward, Mitchell. It's pretty straightforward. Uh. <laughs> okay, it only took us 30 minutes, but we got it. Is this kind of how you do it? Love it! <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do? Maybe that's the problem. Yeah, I guess it wasn't broken, it's just leaky. I don't know. No wonder it's your third backup. <laughs> I guess that one's not very surprising. Yeah, that's a rubber mallet. <laughs> Moment of truth. This one was actually really hard, so here's the clip, the sandblasted clip. It's kind of cool. I don't understand it. Do you know how it works? This top half is just a shell. The air comes in here. When you hit it, it releases. It puts this just down here to release this thing to shoot this rod down. Like the air is stored up in like this top chamber first, and then when you hit that, it releases it down to the bottom chamber, which then goes um, something like that? I'm gonna go with yes. Okay. <laughs> as much as it goes, it's up against the seal. Yeah. So it just comes down a little bit, enough to release the air and trigger it. Which then the air then should push this piece back up. It's a little slower when you operate it with a hammer Take instead a of air. <laughs> with a third of a hammer. Take a long time to do a floor. Then the handle's just like hollow and that's where the air comes in. There's yep. like nothing in there. The entire handle is like a chamber, an air chamber. I hope that Addison uses it more like this though. Shoulder is back. He's been using it wrong the entire time if he's not using it like this. And then he gets you know, the hammer on there. That way you don't have to be down on your hands and knees. I'm doing the floor. So. It's a young man's game. <laughs> yeah, who drew it best? This is contestant one, two. There's a third, I think. Kind of up the ante on that one. And three. 